It's really easy to get stuck in the routine of dentistry, you know, fillings and crowns and extractions and all those things. And it's neat when there's something that comes around that takes what you do and moves it to the next level. And I think 3D printing is that thing. My name is Chethan Chetty, and the name of my office is Eagle Rock Family Dentistry. I heard about it from some Facebook groups. Some mentors of mine were sharing some of their experiences with 3D printing and talking about how to use it in dentistry. And it was really fascinating to me. The more you read upon it and look at the different products that were out there, it just kept becoming clear to me that Moonray was the best option as far as 3D printers go. It kind of gives you the best bang for your buck, but also is the easiest and best for my needs. It's accurate, it's easy to maintain, and there's, most importantly, I think it's got a really great user base, a user community, so any issues that I might have, it's really easy to find someone who can help me solve this problem, whether it's a technical or design issue, there's someone always there ready to help out. I'm always kind of a tech nerd, geek kind of guy. So I always love my toys and I love looking at new technology. When it came to dentistry, it's really great to be able to incorporate that kind of love for technology into dentistry. Because like for the longest time, we weren't really able to do that or it wasn't quite there. And so now that it's happening, it's amazing. After doing this for, God, almost 20 years, things start getting a little bit routine. And so to be able to say, hey, you know what? I'm gonna do this a different way. Or all of a sudden I have this whole nother doorway open to me where I can consider doing things using this, I think is really exciting. It's a, it's a new fun thing to do that, you know, at the end of the day, I really believe that it's gonna make the patient experience better and our service to our patients better. I think the biggest thing for me was to be able to do the surgical guides in-house for implant placement. I don't place thousands of implants or anything like that, but when I'm placing an implant, it really makes the procedure much more accurate. It allows me to transfer that digital world into the analog world and really get the results that we plan for and design for in the software. And that for me has been the biggest thing and, and my favorite thing about it. You know, if you're getting a 3D printer, obviously it's something that you want to put to good use. And going digital as it were, and going into 3D printing or any other form of digital dentistry, you really have to make a little bit of a mindset change. And you need to really think about how uh, you take that analog world that we're so used to, you know, stone models and wax and those sort of things and transition it into something that's digital. So, you know, I know there's learning curves and I'm willing to accept those learning curves. And, uh, and once we get out the other side of it, it's just amazing and everyone loves it. And, uh, you know, it's always fun to have new toys and it keeps, it keeps dentistry exciting and it keeps, uh, it keeps it fun and it keeps it interesting.